This is a special presentation of Fox 61 Sports Day. One-on-one -on -one with Dan Hurley on Fox 61. Here's your host, Fox 61 sports anchor Joe D'Ambrosio. Welcome to our third of four visits with the head Husky, Dan Hurley. Nice to see you. And uh, late night with the Huskies, not quite late night with uh, David Letterman, but uh, a good result getting back on track against Tulane. Yeah, just getting, uh, just felt good to get back to the identity that we uh, were able to establish through a lot of non-conference. Um, you know, just uh, making our opponent feel uncomfortable by playing, you know, really good defense and, uh, you know, by playing with a, with a high level of toughness and grittiness, which is, uh, you know, what, what, what I expect to have in place in, in the program right now in year two is just resembling a lot more of the identity uh, that we want to build the program with. You had uh, several people played well, but two in particular. Uh, Tyler played his best all-round game, 1911. And then Al, who learned that his grandma passed away on Tuesday and wanted to play Wednesday night and did, and played extremely well and ran the offense the way that everybody who's seen him play knows that he can he can run the offense. Yeah, I mean, Al was solid. You know, if, if, if we're going to get, you know, uh, you know double-figure points, 11, 12 points, uh, you know, six, seven, eight assists, good on the ball defense. Um, you know, he, he created shots for his teammates. Uh, you know, he initiated with, with, with good ball pressure, and, and he was a he was a good leader out there. Um, you know, if we get that type of play from the point guard position, uh, you know, we'll have a chance. Uh, you know, we'll have a chance in just about every game we play. Uh, and then Tyler, just uh, you know, he, he's you know, he's having a pretty good year. Um, he had a bad week on the road, like we all did last week, and. Uh, you know, he showed, showed more growth, um, you know, which is what we want to see from uh, you know, particularly our younger players, the guys that we're, we're, we're trying to build this thing with. Because you've been through this rebuilding process before at Wagner and Rhode Island, is it easier to stay the course when things get off kilter a little bit and not be like, oh, my God, i got to change the starting lineup, i got to do this, i got to do that? Yeah. No, um, uh, the losses are hard. You know, losing is hard. Last week was hard. Um, you know, even understanding where you're at and um, how far you have to go, and obviously, um, you know, we, we were we were proud of the identity that we were, were developing up up until last week. Um, you know, but for me, it's just part of the process that you go through when you're uh, trying to take a program that uh, you know that had bottomed out and you're rebuilding, and uh, you know, you obviously you, you do that by developing an identity, uh, you know, recruiting, developing. And, and building a strong culture. You had an interesting comment when you met with the media on Tuesday before the game, and you, I asked you about leadership, or somebody asked you about leadership, I'll take credit. And you said, it's hard to get on-court leadership when guys have not been in a winning situation. I never really thought of that before, but that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, I mean, it's um, a lot of it's osmosis, or um, you know, when you enter into a program as a freshman or a sophomore, that's been win winning, competing for championships, has high levels of professionalism, uh, knows how to practice the right way, has the, the confidence in the strength of the organization. You know, that, that you have that winning DNA and that you know you, know, you have older players uh, that have come through in the past that can lead your team and we have to develop and uh, recruit and develop those types of players here. All right, we'll take a break. We'll come back with more with Coach Hurley. Here it's one-on-one -on -one with Dan Hurley on the Friday edition of the Fox 61 Sports Ticket.